hey friends welcome back to another tutorial video and in this video tutorial i will let you know how to read the temperature and humidity value from dhd sensor and print it on our serial monitor so before going to start with this video a small important notification is there that 98 percent viewers are not subscribing to my youtube channel only two percent uh, viewers are subscribing to my youtube channel which is actually not worth it so uh, friends please uh, make sure that you have subscribed to my youtube channel because on upcoming days uh, i am going to upload uh, more videos uh, based on iot and electronics project so please consider to subscribe and uh, hit the thumbs up button for this video and press the bell icon to get an instant notification from me while i'm uploading new new videos like this so without any further ado let's quickly get started with this video to make this project the requirements that we need are Arduino Uno we can even use Arduino Nano as well the connection diagram will be same for both Arduino Uno and Nano DHT11 uh, temperature and hum humidity sensor a breadboard and finally a couple of jumper wires let's move to connection part Follow this circuit diagram and make air connections. This is about the circuit connections. Let's connect our Arduino to our PC for programming part. So as we can see the port is already over here and make sure that before going to upload we have installed this DC.S library in our Arduino IDE software and no need to worry friends I will provide this library link, uh, link in the description down below and also you can get this code and the circuit diagram as well and uh, uh, here I have declared a 2 second delay that means the temperature value will be up, uh, updated in our uh, serial monitor. Uh, in a two second interval of time and uh, before going to uh, upload we just have to verify the code and have to save this and after compiling we just have to go to tools and have to select board as a Arduino Uno and have to select the code and after all we have to upload the code into our Arduino Nano or Uno As you can see the code is uploaded into our Arduino Uno successfully and uh, let's open the serial monitor and check the project. So that's all for today's video. I hope you like this video then do hit that like button and also share this video among with your friends and also subscribe to my channel for more such videos. So I will see you in next video.